in the car, but then when we get to the other side, I won't be able to like do anything until I get back down to our area. So is it yeah. okay to bring them, or are we going to be really tight and wait and speed? It depends Why don't you how. Do you bring know what them? I mean? Because I don't really yeah. want to not be able to charge my phone for an about six hours from here. And we're going to stand on the. Looks that way. Tengo cita el 17 de abril. What kind of uh, plants do you think they are? This is an erigeron, and I know that there's a new species of erigeron being described from Baja California, so I thought I'd better collect this one just in case, because I don't know which one it is. And um, this is a gallium or a bed straw. I've and never seen one that has like leaves this big, and so I don't know which one it is from this region. Uh, are you excited? Yeah! <laughs> Always! <laughs> this really complements our efforts for a better life, a better planet, a better future, sustainable living, and a better understanding of the world around us. Awesome! Heart and soul into my work, and I hope I'm able to. That was so awesome. <laughs> that was amazing. One of the most amazing things I've ever seen. This whole herd of wild donkeys and horses snorting and bucking and jumping. And and somehow Don Chewie just gets them all in the corral. And here, here we're gonna go. Amazing. <laughs> no, I'm the, it's really starting phase two now. Phase <laughs> two. I'm sad because my favorite mule is the oldest lady and he said we're not going to take her. <laughs> Oceano, si, sí. lindo. What are you doing? Oh, I'm closing this press. So normally when we press, we put one cardboard or one newspaper with plant, and this would be a giant press. But because of the mules and the difficulties of the trip, this is what we call a holding press. And so there's a much smaller number of cardboards and a lot of newspapers between each one, and this will just hold them tight till we get back into town and can make big presses that are stable, it won't get knocked around. Can you What's really incredible to me is how amazingly talented people that live in these ranches are, how amazingly capable and competent and how the younger generation can still make more money flipping burgers. What do you have to say today? Buenos dias. <laughs> El cerro. So, I guess uh, so, uh, talk in Lyon, France? Seriously, what's that going on? Oh. <laughs> what well, how'd that happen? What'd you talk about? My research. We're just saying we speak all over the world. We're, we're scientists. We go to international events and we speak on our research. Nobody told me that. It's obvious. <laughs> We're here at the end. The wimps are leaving and Sula is going back over 